I'm Robert Morrison. I'm the Liberty Party candidate for President of the United States. In 1963, President John F. Kennedy made Winston Churchill an honorary citizen of our country. That's a very rare honor, but Winston was a very rare man. JFK said of Winston, he marshaled the English language and sent it into battle. That's true. Winston's eloquent words stirred the hearts and summoned the courage of the British people to resist the evils of Hitler. Winston later said, the British people had the heart of a lion. I had the honor of giving the roar. I cannot equal Winston's eloquence. Who can? But together, we can muster all of American history. We can send our country's history into this liberating strife. What Trump says about immigration is the opposite of what George Washington said. He said we would welcome the poor and the oppressed of every nation and religion. Not all of them to be sure, but more of them. Trump's spewing is the opposite of the words engraved on the base of the Statue of Liberty. She lifts her lamp beside the, the golden door. He extinguishes it. Here's what Lincoln said about immigration. Immigration is an ever-replenishing stream afforded by providence to repair the ravages of internal war. Trump says there's no more room for immigrants. We have 91.9 people per square mile in America. Germany has 623 people per square mile. Which one is safer in this coronavirus pandemic? Trump never says Spite and Dival is too full. Spite and Dival is the old Dutch community that is located near Trump Tower in Manhattan. Spite and Dival has a population density of 19,385 persons per square mile. Nobody says Spite and Dival is too full. Spite and Dival is rich and beautiful. Spite and Dival is the Dutch is the name the Dutch gave to this little corner of the Bronx. It means devil's spew. I like that. That's the best description of Trump's daily discharges of tweets. I call them spite and dival. This is fun. Churchill had a lot of fun fighting Hitler. FDR had a lot of fun too. And oh my, was it Ronald Reagan fun? So that's what we offer our fellow Americans. Let's boot this bad man. Let's rally our history for the fight. And most of all, let's have some fun. It'll drive him nuts in his limousine with a chauffeur. I'm Robert Morrison. God bless our country and God bless each of you. Thanks for listening.